Hello guys, it's Zaddy. Welcome back and what is up everyone. In this video, I'll be explaining to you guys what is the easiest and the fastest way to rank to diamond when you're playing with randoms, especially if you're stuck in the platinum lobby. The reason why I am making this video is because I have been playing platinum lobby a lot. Like both of my accounts are diamonds for the past two seasons. And my fastest record flop platinum 4 to diamond 4 was within 4 days, which was a few days ago. Now, as we know, every lobby is different. If you came from gold and just reached platinum, just know it's a whole different game and a whole different matter. When you're playing with randoms, you have to be very, very careful. You have to know if you should care about these players or not. The easiest way to know if these randoms is worth your attention or not is to know their rank. If the random is ranked platinum 4, it is very likely that they came from gold and they don't know much about the platinum lobby, or they just want to jump right away, get 2 kills and dive in negative points. In other words, the rank number tells the performance of the player in the lobby. Of course, that's not always the case, but mostly when you see a platinum 4 rate or octane, you better be more careful. So, if someone of your random teammates is platinum 1 or 2, you should give your attention to them, try your best to work in team with them, and of course, listen to them as well, as they definitely are invested in ranking to diamond as much as you are. And their main goal is to gain some points. And funny thing about them is that most of these players use teamwork legends like Bloodhound, Lifeline, Ravenant or such. Oh yeah, now talking about legends, well everyone has their one favourite legend, it's not necessary that you have to play that legend. I know how you all enjoy playing octanes and raids, but when you're playing with randoms, try to know that you might have to solo sometimes. So definitely try to choose a legend which would help you escape faster if at any point you have to ditch your teammates. In certain situations like the whole enemy squad is alive and both your teammates are dead. So. Movement scores are the way to go. You can't play Watson or Caustic, especially in Olympus. So now, yeah, talking about Olympus, the map, the best spot to jump is not straight down because that's where all the Platinum 4 players are going to be jumping and they definitely want to stay in Platinum 4. And the very end of the line is also not an option because that's where all the latecomers are going to be jumping and yeah, all the desperate people who want to get points. So the best area to jump at is somewhere far in the map. Somewhere like Rift or Orbital Cannon, especially if the jump ship is a bit far away from these locations. You should definitely avoid jumping in areas like Hammond Labs or Energy Depot. That's where you would lose some good points. So, if your squad is jumping there and they are like Platinum 4, try just run away as soon as you get the chance. And yeah, if your squad is worth it, you should always try to work in team. Stay together as a squad, don't wander off, that's very important. So, the matter is, go to a safe spot, get a good loot and don't try to circle around. And if you hear some gunshots, try to third party without dying. Once you get some decent amount of kills or assists, try to play safe. You don't have to push on every fight, especially the fights which would make you go out in the open in open places. When the ring gets smaller, try to play as defensive as possible, that is the best time to use your abilities, playing safe is the key, especially when 5 scores are left. And yeah, last important thing, once you die, try not to get frustrated as long as you gain some points, cause if you get tilted, you'll keep on losing points. Now these are all the main things you need to know when you're playing with randoms in the Olympus map of Season 9 of Apex Legends. Survival is the key even if you're alone, you don't have to give up. I hope you guys liked the video. If you liked it, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Hit me up on Twitch as well, the link will be in the description below. Stay safe guys and take care.